Welcome to Real Life Wednesday. Today I want to talk to you about how someone was led to Christ through a paperclip. The Reverend Butch Huffman is a member of Greater Heights United Methodist Church, and uh, uh, he's a conference missionary. But uh, before he was a conference missionary, he was a pastor, a lead pastor of a church in Selma, North Carolina, serving Edgerton United Methodist. And while there, uh, he uh, met someone, or just barely knew someone, that was looking for a paperclip. And uh, he said, I have a paperclip, and gave this woman a paperclip. And, and when he gave it to her, he said, but I want you to give it back to me. And the woman was a little bit incredulous, uh, you want the paper clip back when I'm done with it? And he said, yes, I want the paper clip back when you're done with it. Well, okay, when I really need it. So what do I do? And he says, you can get back to me on a Sunday morning. Uh, I go uh, to Edgerton United Methodist Church, he said, said, and uh, told her, I I want you to uh, bring this paper clip back to me one Sunday. Um, So she did return the paper clip one Sunday. And that one Sunday, she... She fell in love with this church and fell in love with Christ. She ended up becoming a member of this church. And on Butch's last Sunday, she gave him a a big jar full of paper clips and gratitude that she was given the opportunity to return a paper clip because that paper clip that she was was loaned uh, led her to Christ. It says in Colossians 3, whatever we do, whatever we have, may it be for the glory of Christ. May whatever you have, whether it's paper clips or whatever it is, May it be for Christ's glory. Amen, amen.